Hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, I want to show you my favorite that I have bought. So I haven't done a favorites video for quite some time. So I have been shopping because of the coronavirus. There's nothing else to do. So do you know what? I thought I would just kind of collect all my kind of things that I bought and I would show you, um, sorry, this top, I don't know if it should be like this, I don't know. Um, this is one of the tops that I bought. So um, let me just go into this kind of, uh, not a haul, I don't like hauls, just a kind of, oh, by the way, it's so warm in this house today. I've put the heating on, I'm just sauntering. So I wanna just take you through my favorites that I think that I really, really enjoy this month and I'm excited to show you. First of all, um, I hope you guys are, you know, keeping safe in this coronavirus. Um, I've heard about the George Floyd incident um, and I'm deeply disgusted with it all and really, really feel for his family, for everything they're going through and things have got to change, guys. Things have to change. Racism must, must stop, but things have to change, guys, you know, and I hope you know anyone that lives in minnesota if i have any subscribers that live there i hope you're all safe i've heard about the looting and the riots and it's just so scary and i just i send you all my love and support and well wishes and i hope that we can resolve this sorry mess um and i hope we get justice for what happened to poor george racism is just not acceptable in any form or manner it's especially in 2020 it's just a no-go so anyway guys i just wanted to say that to you guys and i wanted to kind of bring awareness to the subject and to let you guys know that i'm all here for you if you ever need me i'm just literally i'm just a, on instagram you know snapchat you can always message me and you guys do message me i really appreciate that because you really do mean the world to me guys you know this so the first uh big favorite not big favorite the first favorite i have i have makeup items now, I have bought the uh, Subculture and Strip Down from MAC. And I just fancy something different because um, I normally wear the Spice from MAC. My hair's looking really, really weird. I normally wear Spice from MAC. And Spice is, is very nice, but I was getting very fed up of it. Um, I was wanting something different, something kind of more muted brown. So these two combos are just a match made in heaven and i love these so much um i layer them i kind of put the dark on the outside and then go with the light i also have another one from oh, from l'oreal it's the toffee color at l'oreal crayon i think it's called and i'm just obsessed with these i love anything brown anything muted anything creamy kind of colors it's, it's just everything so these two and i let me do you a swatch as well guys because just to see so this is subculture is that that one sorry i'm not very good at this because i'm not a beauty guru <laughs> and this is stripped down so stripped down is much more of a brownie creamy color and i really really love them i think they're so amazing mixed together on 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 its own on their own are just fabulous amazing guys um i am also wearing some new rings these are from asos and i'll just show you there this is a baguette ring and it has different colors and then I have these 14 karat gold um, rings with sterling silver and plate, um, solid sterling silver. And then I have this cubic uh, stone um, sterling silver ring as well. So I really like rings and I really wanted to get myself some quality rings that aren't just rubbish. Um, sorry guys, this is really pissing me off. Sorry guys, I've just brushed, I've just straightened my hair, uh, curled my hair and it still needs to kind of fall. Um, so yeah, I wanted to have some, some stuff, some earrings, some earrings, some, some rings that are quality and they're not kind of rubbish. Um, so I kind of invested in these rings and I really, really love them. I think these are very, very much in these kind of baguettes, different colored rings. And another favorite guys, I'm wearing it now. I'm wearing the Urban Outfitters, um, sublime t-shirt that i've seen everyone and their and their mothers wear i've seen everyone wear this and it's just an amazing top um so oversized and beautiful i love them i've seen hrh wearing it and i thought i need this 
as well as Nicole Guerrero and I just needed it. So this was very expensive guys. This was $36 with $30 shipping and then I had to pay $15 for the um, uh, import tax. So it was a little, so much money. And I love this guys, it's so, so gorgeous. I also have another one here that I bought and this is the Van Halen t-shirt. Again, very, very big. Um, in America, everyone's wearing it. I don't know if you've probably got them. You've probably got them in the store in America, but I have to get mine imported because we don't have these in England. As you can see, $39, $39 these are. Uh, this is, and I'm going to put this on, guys, so you can see what it's like. And I love it. Oh, is it stopped recording? So this is the second top, guys, and I absolutely adore this just as much as the other one. It's very distressed and it has holes in it, very oversized. Um, I'm just in love. I just think the colour is so gorgeous. Very, very, um, it just looks quality and I love the kind of uh, fluores fluorescent kind of pastel colours on the T-shirt. I really, really like this one, guys. So, yay! When I literally, uh, what was I going to say? When I ordered this top, I was thinking to myself, oh my God, I don't think it's going to arrive because I was just so worried about it coming. Because um, in America, um, I couldn't actually believe that this top would be shipped in England because it's such a sought after top. And I've not seen anyone in England wear this top. Like, it's just an American, it's an American top. It's from America, you know. We have urban outfitters over here, but it's very different to uh, your Amer uh, urban outfitters. We have different stock. And I kind of thought this is too, too, too good to be true that it was shipped to England, but it was. And I, and I just couldn't believe it, guys. So, this is, I mean, I'm going to be living in this top because the amount of money it costs me, I'm never going to take it off with all the shipping and all that. So the next favourite is this. I bought some LED lights um, for my bedroom, for filming. I might drape them over the white curtains when I do a mukbang. Um, absolutely love them. I think they're amazing. And I really wanted something purple because purple lighting is very in. Why is the heating? It's just so hot in here, guys. I can't even breathe. Um, so I really, really like those. Um, that's my next favourite. I also have, I bought myself, I've been very naughty, and I bought myself the AirPods. From Apple. These are them and I, I've been using these for my mukbangs because it's so much better for audio, you can hear yourself and um, I love them. Just really really nice uh, headphones with the kind of lightning, not lightning, yeah lightning connector and these are amazing and I, wear, I listen to, to music in these all the time with these. Uh, and I actually bought Crystal Pear as well because I'm nice. Um, so these were quite expensive, as you know, but it's an investment. I was sick of getting the headphones tangled all the time when I was listening to music, you know, with the old ones. I just thought, oh, God, I can't be doing it with it at all. He's still touching my hair, but guys, I just can't stop. Um, I've just had my hair done, actually, as well, guys. I don't know if you can tell. I did it myself. Can you believe it? I added some foils. I was so scared. I was ringing my hairdressers, asking her, how do I do it? How do I do it? She taught me step by step. And luckily, I'm quite good with hair. I used to do my own hair. So I hope you like it, guys. It's still very tight because I've curled it as well. It needs to fall. But I think it's hot. <laughs> I feel like on a, on a mission. The next thing I bought myself are some ghd straighteners these are the gold edition I, I believe and these are absolutely gorgeous guys honestly amazing um i'll wrap them up um i had some old ghds but they just weren't cutting it for me um well they actually broke so i was using some Remington. was it remington no, they were fabulous and they weren't as good they were rubbish actually so i had to just i thought just like i need to invest in some nice um straighteners so back on ghd love ghds always have done always will straightens my hair so so fast and so easily i've actually spent quite a lot this month um and yeah in love with these i've also bought some uh, this is a hot air rolling iron not iron uh, roller so don't mind the hair it has my extensions in it the hair 
and what you do is you just click two buttons here these are this is the babyliss big hair and it kind of rolls your hair i need to take a breath i can't breathe god i'm literally like out of breath it's so warm so it kind of it curls your hair um with this rotating action so what you do you click that button and it rotates and it gives you that salon blowout which i really really love and you've probably noticed it in some of my videos uh when my hair looks kind of uh, bouncy at the top this is from that in love and then i also bought this one as well <laughs> this one doesn't spin and this is the babyliss um hot hot wand or something i don't know this isn't as good as the other one because it doesn't spin but it's I think it's better for smaller curls. It's a smaller barrel, this one. Okay. So the next favourite, can you see me? Is, why am I like storming through this like there's no, no tomorrow? I have bought, you know my, I'm very into tie-dye at the minute, guys. So I bought myself a couple of tie-dye tops the red one is in the wash and a lot of you have asked where these are from these are from ebay i couldn't believe it um very oversized i, I wear these as t-shirt dresses um wear them all the time i just love like oversized like this t-shirts i live in them love them with some biker shorts i think they look really really cool stop touching my hair um then jewelry wise i bought myself a couple of ear cuffs um so here we are gonna try and zoom it in but it's gonna be difficult there we go guys can you see and these are very in at the minute like the ring um kind of baguettes different colored stones in rings and uh, cuffs and uh necklaces are really in at the minute so i really really like these i basically just pop them on my ear like that let me put that one there and then i kind of just maybe layer it up with another one very easy to do but these kind of do fall out quite a bit i think that looks really cool then i got myself a new uh mascara this is the um volume reveal by bourgeois bourgeois this is okay i mean i'm not really mascara for me it's very hard to find a decent mascara because I kind of just kind of go through that. The one ama most amazing mascara is the, um, boot, oh, is it boot? What is it? Bourgeois. Roller Lash. Is that Bourgeois? I think it is. Roller Lash. That is a good one. Fucking hell. I don't know what they're doing. They've been banging all day. Every time we do a video, it's people like starting up a fucking God knows what. Yeah, so, um, oh, God's sake, people are annoying. Um, so, yeah, but they didn't have this one, so I thought, you know, I'm going to use this. I'm going to try this. I like the spoolie because it's a thin spoolie, and it uh, has a mirror as well, which I thought was quite cool, but it doesn't really do anything for me because it's quite awkward to kind of look. Do you know what I mean? Oops, that reminds me. shut up uh, right guys um so next i wanna the last i think this is the last one now so guys the last favorite is this beautiful handbag from asian handmade now they reach out to me on instagram um i will leave you their instagram is asian handmade and their facebook is proudly asian handmade and i'm telling you guys these handbags are beautiful so i was lucky enough to pick my own handbag. I chose white because white is my color. And these are beautifully made bags, all handmade and beautiful and just insane. I think this would be perfect as a beach bag. Um, so gorgeous. So please go purchase yourself a bag. I think they're gorgeous. And I like the small one because I like small bags. And I just think this, these are, can you shut up? sake 
these are so beautiful guys they are really really amazing i can't believe i just said that <laughs> Fuck. so annoying yeah these are so beautiful guys honestly it's time again just just at all yeah these are amazing guys and please go on their website on instagram i'll put the handle below um and just check them out they're amazing they're an amazing small company and for them to reach out to me send me a free bag in this pandemic is speaks volumes guys so please check these out buy yourself one buy your sister one and look at the gorgeous handles i mean so unique so gorgeous so bespoke i think that might be it guys I feel like I was like racing through it. I don't know why. Oh, I have one more favourite. I have bought myself a rug from Ikea. This is a sh uh, sheepskin. Sheeps it is sheepskin, isn't it? I was going to snakeskin. A sheepskin rug from Ikea. And I like to drape this on my uh, couch. And I have have one for my uh, bedroom for the floor as well. And it's so, so soft. So gorgeous. And they really, um, they delivered in like, I, I bought this round about the start of the uh, pandemic and I've been using it and I absolutely love it, guys. It's beautiful. Um, and it just brightens up the, the home. It really does. I think that might be it, guys. I just want to say uh, thank you for 12,900 12, yeah, 12, subscribers. We're nearly at 13K. I will be doing a giveaway at 13K, guys. So please... You know, let's get to 13k and that would mean the world to me, guys. We are doing so well. Thank you for watching my videos, my uh, supporting me, messaging me, commenting me. All your messages. I mean, I had the most heartfelt message the other day that I won't repeat. But oh my God, it meant the absolute world to me. You guys are the reason why I do this. And you, li you have lifted me up through horrible times. I mean, I'm going through a terrible time right now, which I will speak about when I'm ready, when I can. But... Knowing that you guys are there for me means the absolute world and you guys are my friends and my supporters and you get me. Not many people do. So I just want to say thank you for everyone for watching my videos. I hope you've enjoyed this sit down video. Sorry if I've kind of sped through. I don't know why. I just feel a bit out. I think it's the coffee this morning again. Um, I just really, really, really love you all and I always will. And I hope it's not busy. I hope you all have an amazing rest of the day and I will see you in my next video.